I hope you're all doing very well. I hope you had an amazing September. It's now almost October. I'm so excited. September was great. I discovered some really great products and I also have some fashion favorites going on. So the very first thing I want to share is my fashion favorite. This is a Kate Spade necklace that I got from my husband. He's so sweet. So BeautyCon was coming up and I bought this like black dress from um, H&M. I'll actually have a photo right there. And that dress was only like $20. It was a good dress because I got it in like black and white. Anyhow, this is not a haul video. And um, I didn't know what accessories to wear. And my husband's like, wait a second, I have something to show you. And then he like comes out with this Kate Spade little pouch and this gorgeous necklace. And I was all like, oh! I, I swear, I think I cried when I got it because that was really sweet. I love little surprises. But the thing is, it, it meant even more because when we were on our Asia trip, we were in the airplane looking at brochures, you know, like that brochure where you can buy stuff at the airplane. And we saw this necklace and we were like, wow, that is one intricate, beautiful necklace. But I was like, eh, I don't need to buy it because it's so fancy. Where am I going to go with it, right? But I could wear it on YouTube though, right? <laughs> so this is my favorite, my fashion favorite. I have another fashion favorite and it is this bracelet right here. I love it. It's from my mother-in-law, Susan. And I think she got it from Pier 1 Import. So I'm really, I really thank you, Susan. She just randomly surprised me one time when we visited them. So I love it and I appreciate it. And I I wear it so Susan if you're watching I love you and then let me see I want to go on and share my beauty favorites and then I'll continue on with um, like random favorites also book favorites as well as a giveaway alrighty so for beauty favorites I've been really obsessed with the Tarte Amazonian clay lipstick in the shade playful it's the Ooh, I can't even read. Tarte Glamazon Pure Performance Lipstick. It's the new one. And oh my goodness, this lipstick shade that I'm wearing, I wear it all the time now. Like, I've never been the type of person who likes burgundy lips or like even red. But I don't know what it is. The moment I put this on, I just can't stop. There's no other color that I like anymore. It's just the only color that I wear all the time. It's just so, I definitely recommend it. But it is super pricey. But I like that it's, you know, super, it's a super safe brand. Tarte is free of synthetic parabens and and all of that jazz. So I like Tarte a lot. And, and I have another Tarte product that I really like. It is the Tarte Amazonian Clay 12 Hour Full Coverage Foundation. And I got this at Sephora. My friend Jessica, my bestie Jessica actually, she recommended it because she and I both like have the same skin type and I was like so what do you recommend and she was like oh I've been loving the Tarte foundation so of course I had to buy it so we went to Sephora and I got it and I just love it it is full coverage and I mean super thick creamy full coverage so you have to really blend it in and it's so great if you have like really oily skin because I feel as though it absorbs the skin it, or it absorbs the oil it's really great and my, my friend Jackie actually color matched me and I am actually quite tan I think my shade is tan so thank you Jackie for color matching me she's an amazing friend and I was like ooh I got the perfect match this matches my skin tone so beautifully I don't know if it blends in or if it like adjusts but I've never really had a foundation that matches my skin Skin so well it like really matches it has like these yellow undertones I and love the longest it. time I would not use any other eyelash curler than my Shu Uemura eyelash curler hopefully I'm saying it right but I've had that shoe that old eyelash curler for like five years now and then Mally Beauty came up with this eyelash curler that was heated and oh my words I like this it is you know, it does take longer for me to adjust to it because I'm so used to using my other eyelash curler. But oh my goodness, I feel the warmth when I curl my lashes. And I feel as though the heated eyelash curlers make your lashes stay like up longer because it uses heat. It's kind of like the idea of curling your Alrighty, hair. so now I'm going to talk about some skincare, hair care, and then book favorites, and then a giveaway. So I remember talking about the acne.org last month. I spoke too soon because it's actually working for me. The problem was I think I wasn't using enough of the acne.org um, benzoyl peroxide. I was using like a pea size, but I actually needed to use a lot more. My face is drying, and during that you know special time of the month, you know your period, my period, <laughs> um, my skin still breaks out. But throughout the month where I'm not on my period, my skin seems to do well 
with acne.org. You know, we're girls. I'm sure many of you can relate. So if you know of something that works for, you know, hormonal acne, please let me know because I have really bad skin. <laughs> Thank you in advance. Um, so that is my favorite right now. Like last month, it was not my favorite, but now I'm liking acne.org. So woohoo! And on to Dermalogica. So I really like their micro foliant cleanser. Oh my goodness, that stuff is good. But um, for this month, I'll mention that another month, but for this month, my favorite is Dermalogica Antioxidant Hydra Mist. You just mist your face and I use it for actually setting my makeup because I ran out of Scandinavia and I'm running out of my Urban Decay, the D-Slick one. So this is the one I'm using and I like it. I really do like it. You just mist your face. And I noticed that I can't even miss my... <laughs> I just made the weirdest face. I just noticed that um, it doesn't even mess with my eye makeup. And I don't wear waterproof mascara, but it would mess with eye makeup if you're like, you know, doing it like up close. Like, hello. So you have to like do it kind of far away. Like that. And I like the way it smells. There's like this herbally scent. Kind of reminds me of the Caudalie Beauty Elixir that I really love. So that's that. And now, are you ready? Are you ready? Ooh, can I do a smell? Like, I forgot to m mention one of my favorite smells lately. I think I'm going to do it since it's right here. So, this is a discontinued scent from Bath & Body Works. It's called Juniper Breeze. I love this scent. And the reason why I'm mentioning it is because you can actually find this during their, um, you know, their semi-annual sales. Holiday is coming up. They're going to be having those semi-annual sales. And I got this for $3 at Bath & Body Works. So, I love, I love it. It smells so good and I, it's just really fresh. When I was a, a college student and I was a waitress, I used to bring this with me at work because, you know, I would get really sweaty busting tables and, you know, taking orders and running food and stuff. And I would put this on every now and then and every couple of hours. And I would get so many compliments. So if you, you know, um, need to freshen up, definitely, you know, Bath and Body Works G. And, um, the thing that I wanted to mention is a book favorite. I actually love, love, love The Notebook. You know this is an oldie, but it's a goodie. I goodie, you know why? Because this is like an ultimate love story. This book I read for like three times and I don't know what it is. I just can't get over it. It just touches my heart. It's just the most beautiful love story. This I've book makes read. me happy. It makes me really happy. It's, it's by Joel Osteen. It's called Become a Better. I like this book because no matter where you are in life, you can always be a better version of yourself. You can oh, and also I like this book because like, you know those times when you don't believe in yourself? This book really helps you realize that you know, you were put on this earth to do something in your life and there's no other person in this world who is you, who can accomplish your mission in life. And that's why I like the book so much because it, it, in, it inspires me, it encourages me, it makes me feel like I'm here for a reason. And I just, I love that. So I definitely love Joel Olstein's um, Become a Better You. And I haven't finished it yet, but so far I am it makes me all psyched, like I can do this. <laughs> yeah, so I love it. And I'm actually really loving my um, my Nexus tablet and my my pretty pink case that my hubby got me. So loving that as well. Ooh, it's my first technology favorite. And last but not least, I have a favorite. This is a super cute favorite. It is a Mally Beauty. I'm giving you the Mally Beauty City Chic Smoky Eye Kit. Fancy. So you will be getting this liner right here and I'll also have a photo and a blog post for you so that you can really see what I'm giving you and then you're also getting the Mele Beauty City Chic Smoky Eye I, I can ooh was that me burping I'm so sorry <laughs> anyhow so I'm giving this away I'm it's international I think I'm gonna be giving away like like little prizes at least like once a month throughout my blog, my Facebook, my Twitter, my Instagram, or my Pinterest. So I have lots of social media sites where I can give stuff away. But this video, um, this um, Mally thing, I just want you to tweet at me and I'll have the information in the description box below. So you're just gonna be tweeting like, oh, I wanna win the Mally Beauty thing or some, I don't know, I'll have it in the info box because I haven't really figured out what you guys should tweet me. I wanna mention a favorite food. So I have a cooking channel, it's called Cook with April, and every single Tuesday I make cooking videos. I call it Tasty Tuesday, and my husband Justin is my taste tester. Anyhow, 
And from now on, at the end of every monthly favorite, I want to mention my favorite recipe that I made. And hands down, my favorite recipe that I made for the month of September is cream puffs. Oh my goodness, they are so good. They taste even better than the ones you could buy. I kid you not, they're so delicious. And I had many friends taste it and they said it was good. So I trust their opinion and I, I hope that you like it too. So I'll have the link of the cream puffs in the description box below. Thank you friends so much for watching. I wish you all a beautiful October. I am so excited because I'm already making a lot of Halloween tutorials. I have so much more tutorials to go and I look forward to having you watch them and maybe kind of figuring out what you want to be for Halloween. So have a beautiful day. I'll see you in my next video. Bye!